A T-34 tank, a lost World War II plane, 3,000-year-old edible butter, creepy swamp eels, mammoth skeleton along with many other shocking things when swamps that shock the whole world. Buffalo stuck in swamp Imagine being a defenseless herbivore and then getting stuck in a swamp. It's like nature preparing you to present you with a feast to carnivores. This poor buffalo went through the same ordeal. It was stuck in a pool of mud and a pride of lions came in to take their share of meat from it. Though they struggled to get to the buffalo, in the end, the buffalo died in the jaws of the lion. After a while, when the pride left the partially eaten buffalo in the swamp, a hyena came to take a bite out of it. Swamp Eels Though there are 34,000 species of bony fish, swamp eels are very unique among them. They can be found close to freshwater streams, in mud and swamps. One of them, however, was once found burrowing and dwelling through the soil like a termite. And therefore, it's been discovered that they've evolved to practice an active subterranean lifestyle. T-34 Tank The T-34 is a Soviet medium tank which was produced from 1940 to 1958. It was regarded as the world's best tank when the Soviet Union entered the Second World War. One of such tanks, T-34, was found in a lake near eastern Estonia. During World War II, the 50-kilometer-wide Narva Front was the location of fierce battles and an estimated 100,000 men were killed and more than 300,000 were wounded. It has been speculated that the Germans used this tank and then drove it into the lake so the advancing Soviet army would not use it against them. The tank was 12 feet in water, 6 more feet in peat, and a lot of silt covered it. It took two weeks for volunteers to wash the silt from the tank. The tank was then pulled to the shore and the 116 pieces of ammunition were removed from it. It is now parked in a war museum in the village of Gorodenko. Bog Butter here, listen to this entry very carefully, and you can make butter that is edible for over 3,000 years, though you won't be living by then to eat that. I'm not kidding, people actually found it all around the world in swamps, especially in Ireland and Britain. It's called bog butter, wherein bog is any natural wetland, like a swamp or marsh, and butter is, well, butter. The water in swamps is usually very acidic and low in oxygen, so nothing decomposes, an ideal place to preserve things. It looks like our ancestors, some 3,000 years ago, used to do that. So far, more than 430 caches of butter have been found in bogs, some small as fists, some big as barrels, and finders have reported them edible and still delicious. Monstrous Catfish This monstrous catfish was caught when the water level rose due to rain. The people in the clip bait the fish, and there it was, caught by them. Not as easily as I have said it. It took quite an effort from the villagers while catching it, but when she came out, the efforts looked all worth it. Wait, wait, comes on. Wait, 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 wait. Now, now, now. The fish was otherworldly when it came to its sheer beauty and weighed around 166 pounds. They weighed it, spent some time with their catch, and then released it back in the water. Mammoth Skeleton Scientists have excavated a nearly mammoth skeleton from a soybean farm of a farmer named James Bristle. The man hails from Chelsea, Michigan, and was digging in his soybean field when he stumbled on something hard. He thought he'd discovered a completely buried fence post, but it was a lot more than that. Those were the ribs of a mammoth. Archaeologists from the University of Michigan spent a whole day extracting the site. According to them, the mammoth skeleton was between 11,000 and 15,000 years old and had been butchered by early humans. It was left in a pond to preserve its meat. The skeleton was of an adult male mammoth who was probably 40 years old when he was taken down by humans. The Fishing Cat Life in Sri Lankan mangroves is not easy, but there's one creature that has surprised everyone by its ability to adapt to the difficult conditions of swamp, the fishing cat. Normally, cats don't like to go near where water is, but this exceedingly unique cat is found in the murky swamps, swimming and finding food. The competition on land was too much for cats, so they were forced to find a new niche for them to survive, and they turned to water. They've evolved to have a fairly large size, short legs, deep chests, and short stubby tails, everything helping them to thrive in these swamps. They spend most of their time hunting in the water. They've been given the name fishing cats because they've specialized in hunting fish and got their name for a reason. Unfortunately, the mysterious fishing cats are disappearing around the world because of hard living conditions. Pixie Who doesn't love Star Wars? 
this dude does, and used to capture many mythical creatures in forests, including goblins. In this clip, he went to search out for pixies in a jungle where he made a weird sound to call them. Fortunately, he found one behind him on the rock. Pixies are said to be the souls of children who were not baptized and, wow, he found one of them. Isn't that cool? Swamp Coast In 1942, an American World War II plane named USB-17E bomber was used for heavy bombing in war zones where it got riddled with bullets and crashed in a nearby swamp. Fortunately, all nine members were saved, but the plane vanished for 30 years. It was discovered in 1972 by some Australian soldiers who were flying overhead in a helicopter. They spotted something huge lying in a swamp. They landed and found out that it was an almost intact plane and called it Swamp Ghost. The plane was retrieved from the swamp and now stands proudly at the Pacific Museum in Pearl Harbor in Hawaii. The Cavern of Lost Souls A cave that is full of water and thousands of abandoned cars. Well, this is exactly what we're calling the Cavern of Lost Souls. It is a famous abandoned car cave in Wales. The cars that people buy with such love, how do they even gather the courage to abandon them? I think the Cavern of Lost Souls has also been asking the same question while patiently lying beneath a mountain. The route of this marshy, flooded cave is fraught with danger, and attempting to reach it could very well kill you. This didn't stop people from going there. Why would it? It's an adrenaline rush for them. Bronze Age Battlefield a man found a human arm sticking out of the muddy shores of a riverbank. Soon, a lot of human remains were unearthed, and Tolentz Valley in Germany came to be known as the epic battlefield of Bronze Age men. The wounds with which they died and the number of skeletons were horrifying. In just hours, 130 skeletons were unearthed, with the number still rising. Archaeologists realized that they were standing not on marshy land, but on an epic battlefield of Bronze Age men in 1250 BC the oldest remains to ever be found. It unveiled professional fighters and warfare on a scale never before seen in the area, and has been considered the earliest example of direct conflict between warriors with weapons. Windover Archaeological Site Now known as the Windover Archaeological Site, this once marshy swamp area was nothing to be looked at, but when it was partially excavated by workers to build a road on it, the remains that were discovered from there proved to be one of the most important archaeological discoveries to date. The swamp held the skeletal remains of 168 humans, who probably lived between 9000 and 8000 BC. The most interesting thing came when the archaeologists found out that the remains of those 168 skeletons were very well preserved in the peat at the bottom of the pond, and the researchers were able to analyze DNA from brain tissue. Sinkhole Shot in Bayou Corn, Louisiana, this one in a million clip was shot when a huge sinkhole was forming there, swallowing fully grown trees never to be seen again. The sinkhole was so huge and massive, it swallowed the trees in 19 seconds once it started. This was created after an underground salt dome collapsed, and even after years, the sinkhole is still growing. More than 25 acres in width, the Bayou Corn sinkhole is as big as 20 football fields and is still lazily growing towards an earthen berm built to contain its oily waters. Well, it appears to be a ghost flying or floating over a swamp, which is quite a creepy sight. I mean, what on earth would you do if you spotted one? Tell us in the comments section. Grinch Snake the Grinch was one of the most famous Hallmark characters of how the Grinch stole Christmas. Well, in this entry, we have a new evolutionary form of it. In Thailand, someone just saw a mythological creature that looked quite similar to the fictional character, but this one was in the form of a snake. It is said that this was a normal snake, but the algae formation has made it similar to the mythological creature who hates Christmas days, especially the Christmas carols and holidays. You could say the Grinch exists under the water. White Moose Thidwick the Big-Hearted Moose was a story that almost every kid loved to read. It was difficult to say whether it exists or not, but in this video, we have this mythical moose. In 2007, this bright white creature was spotted in Sweden, taking a dip in the lake. It is rare and is not an albino. Well, now you can say that you saw Thidwick the Big-Hearted Moose. Sea Dragon you might have heard about dragons who lived near the castle and never let a common man enter it. Well, there might be a castle under the sea, because in this video, we have a sea dragon. 
The divers were shocked after seeing this mini dragon swimming under the water. I wonder if it would not burn the fish by blowing a fire. So brilliant. Blue and green and red. They're related to the seahorses, but they're... Komodo dragon. In early 1900s, a myth came forward that a land-living crocodile was seen. It actually exists in Indonesia. These two guys actually went to see this mythical creature. Well, after the movie Komodo, this creature got a real hype. It is said that in the 1910s, this mythological species ate a lieutenant and only left the skin of it. It's also held responsible for many missing reports. So watch out while going to Indonesia or the Komodo will eat you. <laughs> Bigfoot. You might have read the story, The Boy Who Cried Bigfoot. Well, many people have actually cried Bigfoot. And in this clip, we have people who went to visit the Idaho jungle, but they saw something lurking behind the trees. They followed it, but it ran away so fast that they were unable to get a close shot of it. Anyways, I think Bigfoot shifted from the Himalayas because it wanted a change in weather. Give me the camera. Unicorn. From Barbie stories to Siberia's princess stories, we have one thing that every girl wants to see and keep, and that is a unicorn horse. In this clip, we have your favorite horse eating grass though it is at a distance, which makes it quite blurry. This creature is mentioned nine times in the Bible. You might have heard that unicorn will be only available in heaven. Well, some say it's not true, but I think God Almighty planned to show a glimpse of it on Earth. I hope now you guys will be happy to see this famous mythical creature. Musk Deer World is fighting and deciding whether vampires are real or not, while some people saw real vampires. Yes, this mythological creature does exist, but in the shape of a deer. It is said that now they are endangered, and this family is actually trying to keep them alive, but they fear that these creeps will be gone soon as their food diet is difficult to manage. While well, it does not go for sucking blood and are actually herbivores, it is also said that the other reason behind its extinction is the hunting done by humans for musk perfumes. Iguana Do you remember the monster iguana from The Journey to the Mysterious Island? We actually have it in the real world. In this clip, we have Prince of Wales, Prince Charles, who actually played with a blue iguana from the Cayman Islands. While he patted him when everyone assured him that it was safe, it only bites when it's angry. This mythical creature is said to be from the era of dragons, and now they are human friendly. Skunk Ape You might have read a story named Seized by the Skunk Ape. Now you might have heard that it's not true, but in this clip, we have a skunk ape recorded by people which shows that it actually exists. The legend of Florida's jungle and the relatives of Bigfoot is said to live peacefully in the forest with several myths of attacking people and sometimes killing them. Have you seen a skunk ape? Drop your experience below. Swallowtail Caterpillar Sometimes cartoonists draw a character as a fictional one, but it turns out to be a real one. In this clip, we have a character from Pokemon which actually exists. Now, we all know Pokemon is a super fictional cartoon series, but hey, their little caterpillar is actually existing. Caterpie was found by a guy in this video. This mythical creature is said to live on leaves and also feed on leaves. It also turns out to be a beautiful butterfly. How do you guys feel after seeing Caterpie in real life? I wonder if we have more Pokemon characters to see. Anaconda The most mythical monster on Earth is the Anaconda. After the movie Anaconda, people have been terrified of it, and they should be, because here we have a clip where the Anaconda attacked a woman's hand and almost broke her wrist. Her screams show the intensity of pain. Anacondas have a myth that they bite, but in actuality, they suffocate the target and then swallow them whole. Well, this mythical snake is similar to Yakumama, who is said to be the mother of water. It is also said that both swallow its threat and feast, even if it is larger than their size. Wow, so cool! Sloth This smiling creature with extra slow speed is a sloth. But mythologically, they are not slow at all. It is said to be the most adaptable, calm, and diplomatic creature on Earth, just like Sid from the Ice Age. Anyways, it's related to Ergia, which is the personification of a lazy and ideal personality. Now, this is new to see it as a mythical one. Mouse Lemur Do you remember the cute lemur from Madagascar? Well, it's also related to a mythical creature that actually went extinct 
but left their cute version on Earth. It is said that it resembles a mythical character, Takandia, which was a bear-sized lemur. It was thought to be an individual of the extinct koala lemur. Even the locals describe that it moves about in a galloping loop. It was also mentioned that it cries in a very man-like way. Well, this mythical creature was said to be seen by an ornithologist. According to it, there was a bird with bright colors, four legs, two feather horns, and two wings. When this guy uploaded this picture, many people came up saying that they've also seen it. Hmm, it could be true as there are many mythical creatures that actually exist. Well, do you guys know about this mysterious bird? Drop your ideas below. Pegasus In 2015, a Pegasus was recorded on the beach of Spain. It was flying, and it is said that people didn't notice the mythical creature. Well, they might be busy collecting seashells or making castles. Anyway, it is a Greek mythical creature which allowed Bellerophon to ride him and defeat Chimera, which led to many other exploits. It later fell down while trying to reach Mount Olympus, where deities lived, after which Zeus transformed the winged horse onto a constellation. Wow, it does exist in real life, and is said to be seen in the northern sky. Phoenix in this clip, we have something that is truly mythical, and no one would ever believe that it is real. From the film named Maleficent, Mistress of Evil, Phoenix came into the world of reality. A guy captured an object diving in the sky, which looked quite similar to a phoenix bird. While that would be so cool to see a mythical creature flying and diving, do you think that they exist in the real world? Drop your thoughts in the comments section below. Well, that's all about mythical creatures. Don't forget to comment on your favorite mythical creature in the comment box. Also drop your feedback in the feedback section. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.